Hi Cancer, welcome to my channel. I got messages for you. I know it's been a minute, Cancer, so I got you. Let's give you um, some messages here. <clears throat> These messages may resonate right now whenever you watch this reading or whenever. But this is just for the rest of July, beginning um, in August. Okay. So let's get some messages for Cancer, Spirit Guides, Angels, and Ancestors. I'm picking up there's a Capricorn that's in competition with you, Cancer. This could be a spiritual practitioner. Somebody here is coming to you with a fake apology, Cancer. Something here is fake. All right, or two-faced. This may be confirmation for you. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe. Turn your notification bell on, Cancer, so you will not miss any of my videos. You see what I'm saying? Five of Swords. I feel like somebody doesn't like the fact that someone's collaborating with an energy or trying to build something or cooperating. Somebody doesn't like this. This could be some type of uh, group conflict here. Um, this group here is like collaborating or trying to learn something, but at the same time, they're like trying to betray each other or something like that. Cancer. You have the five of cups, regret, feeling sorry or grieving. Somebody could be grieving or I feel like maybe either you could be feeling um, pessimistic or you could be dealing with a Scorpio that's feeling down, feeling pessimistic. Somebody here is feeling bad. Yeah, because I'm getting something here about like laying down or a body or somebody's feeling bad about um, being in a hospital or being hospitalized or they're feeling bad about some type of recovery or that they have to recover or something like that or have to pay for something cancer we have the sun okay so something here is coming out but i feel like it all you know all will be well though the five of cups is going to the four swords to the sun so there will be some type of rest and recuperation cancer there's no need to worry and then we have the tower here so you could be dealing with someone that's intuitive here or somebody's jealous because you're intuitive as hell. Or somebody's jealous because either, I don't know, this may be a reader. Somebody is petty as well that you could have been dealing with. They're very petty or this could be readers like competing with each other here. Yeah, I'm picking up readers competing with each other or they're like, oh no, I'm the empress. No, I'm the empress. No, I'm the empress. I mean, what the fuck is this? Okay. This is petty as fuck. <laughs> All right. So anyway, what's the five of cups? What's this? What's the five of cups? The cancer. We have the knight of cups. Somebody regrets going towards someone with an offer. I feel like either somebody's regretting their decision or they feel like they should have came to you with an offer. Cancer firsthand. All right. Or this is this knight of cups. Heavy Scorpio energy that you could be dealing with. All right, somebody here is like, man, I should have gave some type of proposal here. I shouldn't even indulge with them third parties. Yeah, two of cups. Because I feel like somebody here lied on a soulmate connection, on a soulmate union, or they causing confusion within a soulmate union, a soulmate connection. This could be like two energies that love each other, but then there's the one that's in the middle that's lying. Like, oh, no, you don't love that person or... That person is, I don't know, there's a tarot reader that's confusing people's love life. I'm just going to say that. The Nine of Cups, the Ace of Cups here. But, yeah, somebody's confusing somebody's love life. I just feel like if you want to know anything about your love, just you seek guidance from your ancestors, the most high. You pull a spread on yourself and ask yourself, like, you know what I mean? Ask the most high God, like, what's up? What's the Nine of Cups, Five of Cups? Because... But sometimes other readers be jealous as fuck and I ain't even gonna lie sometimes readers be jealous because you have an emperor or sometimes readers be jealous because you have an empress there and they want to kind of take that for your, for themselves or they want to see how they can jeopardize that because either they're lonely or they're desperate or you know what I mean they want to celebrate on somebody else's downfall or they want to celebrate on making sure two people don't get together which is weird as hell you know what I mean so it's like always in this, oh, I won type of energy. Like, well, you're you're not going to be able to be with your soulmate, Twin Flame. But you know what I mean? So the lovers can talk about um, strengthening your partnership or the strength of two. Or maybe this could be an offer. What's the lovers? Gemini energy. We have the eight of pentacles here in reverse. But I feel like whoever somebody sent their love offer to, they're like, man, no, uh, I'm not focusing on building that. Or somebody here lost a job. They lost, um, 
they're just feeling uninspired to make something work in a connection. I mean, there's love there between you two, Karen. So I'm not even going to front, but it's like somebody here just refuses to work on it. They don't want to work on it. They're just not focusing on this love or they're not focusing on making a choice or maybe whoever somebody possibly was involved with the same sex and they possibly their reputation is ruined because of that. Yeah, so this possibly could have came out because we have the sun and the tower. So there's some type of exposure here. Or this is what someone is thinking about with the four of swords mentally. What's the four of swords? The seven of swords. Look. What's the seven of swords? Four of swords. This is someone sneaking off while you sleep, while you're resting. They're like, no, nah, I'm just, I'm gone. I'm ghost. Or what's the seven of swords? Could be an Aquarius. Yeah, somebody leaving. Seven and eight. Something about divine order somebody was supposed to. We have the seven of swords, the eight of cups. It's like somebody wakes to an energy is like fast asleep. And then they're like, nah, I'm finna go. I'm about to run away. And then I'm finna block all, all communication, all access to you. Yeah, the six of cups. Somebody here is ghosting their past. Period. Their past is the ghost or they're ghosting the past and they want to reconcile with someone. This could be a past story or whatever. But, you know, I'm just here reading the energy. How I like to do it, you know what I mean? My readings is whatever comes out, you know, and that's just what I'm, you know what I mean, talk about. If it's in the future, it's in the future, in the past, and if it's all combined, past, present, and future, then that's just what it is. Take what fit. Lead the rest, okay? We have the Eight of Cups, Seven of Swords. Aquarius, Pisces, Libra, and Energy. Somebody's leaving. Whatever this is, I'm picking up somebody possibly have stole as well because the seven of swords could come out as a thief somebody possibly um this could be a burglar yeah oh somebody's a burglar i'm hearing somebody a cat burglar or something like that somebody's a burglar they went into somebody's house shit that ain't on my desk i ain't got nothing to do with that three <laughs> six of, and then they get exposed what's the sun card we have the nine of cups so a wish fulfillment or somebody's wishing that something was seen and i'm getting it was seen nine of cups in the sun somebody here oh we the world and i feel like a cycle is closed or the whole world is able to see this that somebody's a thief or they're a robber or i don't know the high priestess i feel like whoever this intuitive person is they could have been making a choice here to move or go in another direction impulsively or somebody here try to make a move on a high priestess that makes the right decisions or a high priestess could be planning some type of escape or something like that nine of cups in the sun we have the ace of swords in reverse cancer Somebody either is lying on their children or they're lying saying that someone here is not pregnant. We have 919, okay? Or there's some type of cloud and judgment here when it has to do with you getting getting down to the solution. I'm not really seeing your energy. Somebody here is lying on the family, kids, or, or like they're making it, they're causing some type of confusion here with the family member. This could be a family member of yours that's causing confusion with you. Or somebody's wishing that somebody would expose a lie. This is their wish fulfillment. Like, man, please expose that lie. Tell, I, I really, really want you to expose that lie. And I'm getting, what's the lie? Ace of Swords and Birds here, Four of Cups. Hmm. What's the Four of Cups, Ace of Swords? The Page of Pentacles. Somebody here possibly was turned down or somebody was blocked. Or so whoever this is, they've been lying about doing some type of dark magic or they've been lying about procrastinating or divination spine. This is someone here that's divination spine, okay? And it's like they're trying to get people to expose something or expose the sun is the truth. So somebody here is like trying to get people to expose the truth so they can switch the story and make it seem like it's a lie or something like that. Because with the sun here, the nine of cups, somebody's getting the truth. This is a wish fulfillment for them. You could be dealing with a Pisces, a Leo, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Capricorn, or another cancer such as yourself. But somebody here is like uninterested or they settle or they're like, I don't know. Somebody's trying to form some type of lie. I don't know what this, I don't know. It's like somebody's trying to form something to like, they're trying to meditate on how they could either do some type of dark magic or lie or distract someone. Mm. 
Yeah, so there's some type of divination going on. This could be somebody here lying on a child as well. Or lying on their son or something like that. Also, somebody could be like trying to do... Somebody wants power over someone else's foundation. What's the page of pentacles in reverse? For cancer. We have the king of wands. Leo energy. This could be a fire sign. They're blocked or they're greedy. This is the energy that... Um, I don't know. It's like somebody's bored with some type of offer here. And this is why they procrastinate or this is why they're going through. This is like an energy that takes action. But they get distracted so easily. What's the King of Wands doing here? Let's talk about it. The Strength card. You definitely could be dealing with a Leo or you may have Leo placements in your chart. This could be Cancer Leo energy. Cancer Leo uh, cusp or happy birthday. So by Cancer Leo Cusps, um, what was it, 22nd? I don't know if I did. Okay, well, happy birthday. What's today? The 25th? Ooh, the Lord have mercy. Y'all, I'll be getting. But anyway, never mind. We have the um, King of Wands. Could be taking action to go and bribe someone. But it's like, whoever this is, they're trying to bribe this person. But it's like, somebody's trying to get some information out of someone. And I'm getting this a Leo. A Leo with cancer energy. They're trying to get some information out of someone. Give me this King of Wands strength. They're trying to get some information about somebody's investment or where their money is going. Or, yeah, this could be the pay. Yeah, somebody here is getting bad news. Somebody possibly wants to know how you make money. Or somebody wants the truth about your investments. Or something here that you could be planning. I wouldn't tell nobody shit. This could be someone planning to bribe someone. But then, like... Something doesn't work out in their favor. This could be bad news, legal issues here. Somebody here could have been very incompetent when it has to do with like a judge, a lawyer, or whatever this court litigation is. They could be getting some bad news. Mm -hmm. I feel like somebody has not looked at in a good light. What is this? Somebody here is trying to plan for something. Seven of Pentacles. You could be dealing with a Taurus, a Leo. We have the eight of wands to communicate with you. Or they like, man, I give up. I'm not texting. I'm not saying nothing. I'm not. I don't know. But this could be someone here looking or thinking about some type of text messages, going over all text messages, trying to see what they said or what was said, what was exchanged, emails. And they're trying to figure it out. But the seven of wands here, oh, no. Somebody here didn't protect themselves with the ten of wands. So it's like they're forcing to, like, pay ace of pentacles and they're pissed whatever this is somebody did not they so this could be a child maybe somebody had a baby or you know what i mean they didn't wear any protection right and maybe somebody here is going back like you know hey i'm pregnant it's, i believe this is your child or whatever king of wands like nah let me think about that because seven months ago what was i saying to you maybe somebody had a baby early cancer don't know but somebody here is like, man, that's your child. Somebody here is looking at this baby. They're like, man, that baby don't look like me. It may be somebody else's baby. But whatever this is, maybe somebody's going to take it to court. This is a story that I'm getting. Somebody may be going to take this to court. And something here may be karma here. It may tie into somebody's finances because maybe it may be their child. And they may be... They may put child support on an energy. Don't know. And I, I'm getting somebody could be scared, Karen, sir. I don't know if this is you or, you know, I, I feel like somebody did not protect themselves sexually. And a baby was born up out of this. We have the nine of wands. So something here is at a pause, at a standstill. We have the three of swords. Yeah, so somebody here is like going through a backfire. We have the three of swords, the seven of wands. Or they're being forced to like pay. Somebody's being forced to pay. A lawyer, a judge, or whoever this Aquarius is, this masculine, they're being forced to pay this man. Give me the tower. Forced to pay, yeah, the government. The government, literally, the hierophant and the tower is here. This could be an institution being, like, exposed, a government entity or institution, all right, what somebody has to pay, the six of pentacles. Yeah, somebody here has to pay to like start over or to start fresh or to start a new beginning or something like that. Or what's this? What's the tower? 
somebody here is caught in a fire in a crossfire it's like with the hangman here somebody here is left hanging and it is the last i'm getting the last man standing or something like that that has been enlightened about some type of tower chaos or a fire or something like that that has a cure what's this what's this what's this hangman pisces um i meant pisces taurus scorpio and aries what's the hangman and the hierophant somebody here has got caught yeah the three of swords trying to break somebody's heart or hurt this person or cause some type of emotional pain or grief or this could be someone here that has gone through a divorce because what has been exposed somebody here has got caught what's the three of swords tower hierophant the fool somebody escapes some type of heartbreak they did somebody escaped a heartbreak they escaped some type of betrayal could have been this queen of swords because I feel like somebody has warned someone that they were a cheater or they were a liar. And I feel like somebody here didn't listen. Whoever this is that have embarked on some type of new journey, um, this person has escaped by holding back with the four of pentacles. Or somebody was supposed to hold back from this third party. They didn't want to. They wanted to dive in. What's the fool card? The five of wands. Yeah, somebody escaped conflict or they escaped some type of like whoever they, they was using their intuition. And this could be you, Cancer, with the chariot. I feel like you possibly went in. Maybe you saved yourself from some type of conflict or being in this five of wands is petty shit. You could have freed yourself from this. This could be a whole lot of things going on here within a divorce or some type of chaos here and i feel like you could have been silent about this the chariot the high priestess or somebody here is silent about their moves they could be moving in silence not telling nobody their whereabouts they have escaped whatever this tower was what's the fool and the uh, five of wands i'm trying to tell you by making the right decision cancer you could have aries placements leo placements aquarius libra taurus pisces scorpio or aries placements did i say aries yeah so i feel like somebody here has planned to make the right decision yeah temperance peace moderation i feel like somebody is mad as hell that the divine has stepped in on somebody's behalf because it was just too much chaos going on Somebody possibly was trying to set up someone too here as well. But I feel like whoever this is, they let the past go. They're like, nah, we're going to let the past go. Because I feel like the divine has stepped in. The most high God has stepped in. Like, nah, what you're not going to do is you're not going to get my baby like that. You're not going to do that. You're just not going to do that to my baby. You're not going to do that to my child. you just not. What's the two of wands? Somebody here is highly protected. Yeah, we have the devil here. Somebody does not, they release themselves. They don't have any dark attachments with the devil card in reverse. Somebody is very, very respected here with the Hierophant. This could be a Taurus. This could be a wealthy man, a rich man, a business owner, a CEO, a boss. The King of Pentacles is someone here that has some type of um, wealth attached to them or they have material wealth or whatever this is. This could be a Capricorn um, masculine or a Taurus masculine. But I feel like whoever this is, they don't have any dark attachments to nobody. Somebody made the right choice to release themselves and take their power back from this devil. Look at them. Now they're recovering with the five of cups and people are confused. How are you on this pedestal or how are you winning? Because somebody released themselves from this attachment, from a dark entity, attachment, or a contract, Cancer. That's what I'm seeing. And they decided to hold back. It was hard. Somebody here was forced to hold back. I feel like that was the, the heavens, the most high. They're like, nah, we're going to force your ass to hold back. Hold back. Give me one more card here for cancer. A couple more cards. No, one more. I'm trying to tell you the ancestors is all over this message here, mother. When it has to do with the mother. Cancer, this could be you. Maybe you're the mother. But whoever this is, somebody's ancestors or your mother is the ancestor. Or this could be your mother that's looking out for you, watching over you, protecting you, or somebody here that's a matriarchal figure in your life. Yeah. Somebody's mother is an ancestor. Are you, yeah. And and they was and they was a soldier too. Look. Karen said, your mama was a soldier. <laughs> no, for real. I got chills. But I'm going to leave it there. Like, comment, subscribe. Turn your notification bell on, Karen. So hopefully you was able to find some messages in here. I feel like you you winning. Six of Wands here. You get recognition. Everything is on the up and up for you, Karen.